Alrighty, so we're heading out of Hokkaido, of Chapuro. Um I woke up at 5 a.m. for my 10 a.m. flight to Tokyo. But it's 35 degrees outside and there's snow on the ground. All that white stuff there is snow. We're gonna try and run to get to the air, uh, the subway, how we can get warm, get to the bus stop. <laughs> All right, to the airport three hours before I needed to be here. So got a little potato sandwich, which is light and fluffy, pork cutlet sandwich, and then a green tea. This flight was so cheap, they couldn't even pay to dock us. Have to take the bus to who knows where. Finally made it back to the shop. Still here. My pod for the next couple days in Tokyo. I wanted to try on the Insta pumps. And I actually got them here. Might as well. It's not the main Shibuya crossing, but it's right next to it. So we're still in Shibuya. And now they have a completely new shopping center. This was my favorite ramen spot back in 2016 when I first came. So we're gonna try it out. Didn't get to get the egg, but we're gonna try it out and see if it still slaps. So everybody loves a 3D cat here, but that ramen spot still holds the award for the best uh, buckwheat noodles. So buckwheat noodles are the really thin ones like they have at Ichiran. And they're just really thin noodles and uh, it's still the best ramen for buckwheat because of the way that they season or at least sear the, the pork just is great. I love it. And then right here, there's a uh, pet shop slash cafe so you can do dogs and cats and you know pet them but right now we're gonna go continue to go shopping walking around getting some steps in oh a cafe by joel rabuchon we going in bro we going in so outside of going to his restaurant at mgm this might be as close as we're gonna get in tokyo trying it out Let's see how it is. Got a little something that curry looks like it's curry soup inspired, and then something sweet. I love these little moss bonsais, bonsais. Except, unfortunately, I don't think they would ever make it past the uh, traumatizing plane ride. There's a place called Tokyo Hands that does all their biggest thing is that they do stationery, so anything with ink or lead on paper and oh man the Mitsu this is my favorite pun the Mitsubishi Uniball jet stream oh this thing writes so smoothly it's never failed on me it's a clicking pen I like the clicking pens rather than the pens that have uh caps on them I don't like the ones with caps on them I like clicking ones and this is an actual ink so you can write on it and then it won't smudge afterwards whereas if you click the other ones like the pilots. If you get these pilots, they will smudge, especially because I have sweaty fingers. These do not smudge. It's clicky and they have a uh, 0.38 lead and a 0.5 and a 0.7. The train lines over here. Yeah. 
There's also a volleyball court, mandatory Starbucks. There's just a bunch of young people here. Yeah.